Solve Collectibles are sending their Dreadnought XL Euro 2020 products. They're sending the starter packs, the premium packs, the normal packs, the tins, the multi packs. It's all there at Solve Collectibles. And if you want to save yourself a little bit more money, use the discount code GBW10. That way you'll get 10% off your order of the Fantastic Adrenaline XL Euro 2020 cards. Thank you very much. Let's get on with the video. Hello, everybody. Welcome to a 20 pack opening of the Panini Adrenaline XL Euro 2020 trading cards. In this opening, that's right, we're opening 20 packs. And of course, we'll be building a cheeky little dream team, seeing what kind of team we can build with these 20 packs. The brand new 2021 edition of last year's Adrenaline XL Euro 2020 collection, which obviously uh, the tournament got cancelled due to COVID 19. But yeah, if you're excited to see what kind of cards we can get in these 20 packs and what kind a team we can build make sure to smash the like button you got five seconds really simple task to do so have you done it yet we've got about two more seconds so i'm giving you a bit more time have you done it brilliant let's get into the video So as you can see, here are the 20 packs of the fantastic Adrenaline XL Euro 2020 collection. Brand new for this year, as you can see, 2021 kickoff. And there's eight cards inside every pack. Each pack retails at £1.80. Um, there we go. There is the barcode. So these are all retail packs this time. These are the first retail packs I've actually opened. But of course, there's not much difference between promotional and retail packs when it comes to Panini because they are just elite, really. And there are the odds for each pack, as you can see. So fans cards, one in every pack. Powers, one in every two. Multiples, one in three. Platinums, one in four. Top Masters, one in 16. And Invincibles, one in 55 packs. So hopefully we can back a cheeky Top Master. We should do. They're one in 16. We've got 20 packs right here. We're due a Top Master. So hopefully we can build an epic dream team from the 20 packs we open here. Here's the pack design, of course, for this pack. Lewandowski, Xhaka, and uh, this chap, I don't actually know that guy. He plays for Ukraine. There we go. If you know that chap, comment down below. Uh, but yeah, while we get inside this first pack, of course, if you are new to this channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button so you do not miss any future content from the channel. Of course, we're opening plenty of these cards as well as some uh, match tax extra cards, which are obviously tip both those collections released on the same day. So we're going head to head. And of course, we're bringing you lots of uploads at the moment. So do hit the subscribe button if you are new around here. So uh, we start off with Manchester City and Portugal's Ruben Diaz. And uh, look how clean these cards look. I mentioned it in the um, the starter pack video for this collection. Uh, this is kind of like a middle ground between a um, startup set. So if you're getting into collecting that kind of collection, you start off with. And of course, a collection for higher end collectors as well. Because it kind of has that like that really a premium finish it really does that's what you're paying the extra atp for when it comes to these packs over match tax um yeah it's just fantastic so there we go ruben diaz he can go straight at the back in our team lovely stuff then we've got tom lockyer there for wales of course it's got all the teams who are qualified um for this summer's tournament there's clum and long there nathan ake kieran trippier obviously gave us a cracking moment in the world cup in 2018 and there's the little advertisement there now to get your digital pack. And oh, look at that. That's a lovely shiny card. I absolutely love the shiny cards in this collection. They are epic. Uh, Pepe, fans' favourites for Portugal. We've then got a, oh, nice. We've got one of these ones, which is the uh, multiple power trio of Glick, Szczesny and Bednarek. That is nice. The Polish power trio, though. Defensive trio it is. That is a really nice finish on that as well. And then we've got uh, Gunuk. Goal stopper, uh, Gunuk, however you want to say it, uh, for Turkey. So um, we might as well stick in between the sticks, why not? Uh, so we start off nice and early with a goalkeeper. And obviously we've got quite a few defenders in that pack, actually, if I remember correctly. Yeah, then we've got Longley there. We've got Kieran Trippier, can go right back, obviously, now playing in Spain for Atletico de Madrid. Um, should we put Nathan Ake in? Do we want Tom Locke here as well? We've got all sorts of players. Pepe as well. Look, we've got five at the back already. That is incredible. So there we go. Five at the back. Who needs the rest of the team? We can't obviously use the power trio, so we'll put them to one side. Nice. So good start. Good start indeed, I think. Um, do need some forwards, though, don't we? That's a very defensive pack. Um, but it's always nice to start off with a decent defensive line. Uh, but do let us know if you want to see some draft openings. And, of course, a booster box will be coming uh, to the channel. So, again, hit the subscribe button so you do not miss that. There's Ampadu, um, Rabio, Brozovic, Emre Chan, Courtois. Uh, that guy. <laughs> not going to even try and pronounce that. We've got two of these codes this time for some reason. Might be a good sign. You never know. And we've got, oh, my first ever second skin. So that's the um, that's the respective team's home shirt, I'm pretty sure. So that's awesome. I love the uh, design on that. That is epic. And we've got, oh, my, wow. 
key player, Julian Draxler. This card feels incredible. Once again, Panini smashing it out the park with their card designs and quality. Key player, Julian Draxler for Germany. That is awesome. That oh, I, I say it again. I say it every single collection Panini bring out. Their card quality is unrivaled. It is absolutely incredible. Um, who else do we want from that? We'll put Courtois in instead of uh, Gunok. Yeah, he can go on the bench or whatever. The discard pile, sh uh, shall we say. Uh, Ampadu, I don't think it's going to get in instead of what we've already got. Rabio can go in there. Uh, Brozovic, Brozovic or Chan? Who should we go for? We've got Emre Chan. We're a bit more familiar with him. And uh, yeah, it looks like we're shaping up to build a 5-3-2. Uh, we, we don't build 5-3-2s often, do we? Uh, but I'm sure we'll replace some of these defenders at some point. Uh, we've started off with the insert cards in this pack for whatever reason. Uh, second skin of the Czech Republic. Oh my, what? Look at the design on that card. What? <laughs> I feel like I'm in a trance right now. That is incredible. Andy Robertson dual card. Hello. You can see him in the background. That is epic. Oh my goodness. I'm blown away by that card. That is man. Wow. Again, do you rewind a few minutes. Didn't I just say that Panini's card quality is unrivaled and this just emphasizes that. Blimey. It's like it, it's, it feels 3D. I have never seen a card like that before. That is the best quality card I think I've ever seen. In my time of collecting that is absolutely insane platinum jewel andy robertson lost for words i'm absolutely lost for words we'll take nefanake out and put robertson in wow absolutely incredible that is in i can't speak panini you have blown me away there there's Jal cancelo ethan ampadu again the rabio again oh panini don't <laughs> <laughs> I've just bigged you up there. Don't give me matching packs. Uh, Rodak there, obviously Fulham's goalkeeper. Uh, Gaia and Kieran Tierney. Stop giving me defenders. My goodness me. Uh, Kieran Tierney is a pretty good option, but we've obviously got Robertson a left back now. So um, Rabio already got on the team. Gaia. Um, who, do we replace any of those? I think we keep Kieran Trippier there, in there instead of uh, Jao Cancelo. But we still need a striker. But that that Robertson dual platinum card is just. It's just a thing of beauty. It really is. It's wow. You could have seen me in the card. Oh wow. Anyway, so we've got Nikolic there, uh, Shalutska, Robin Olsen. We've got a security tag, classic Panini security tags. I love putting them in packs. Anthony Martial. So that's a forward. We can put him straight in. There we go. Lovely stuff. And we've got uh, Kulev. Uh, I still can't say his name. Kulusevski, uh, young Swedish international, of course. Uh, should we put him in as well? If he, is he a forward? Yeah, he's a forward. We'll put him in. There we go. 5-3-2. Lovely stuff. And then we've got a code there, whatever it is. And then we got, ooh, Christian Eriksen, fan's favourite this time. For Denmark. Very, very nice. Lovely Danish flag in the background. They, I do like Denmark. I, it just it looks like such a nice place, doesn't it? Uh, then we've got a power card, Victor um, Nilsson Lindelof. Who knew he had Nilsson in his name? Because I didn't, uh, but there we go. Learning something new with Panini. Defensive rock of Lindelof. And, oh, top master, Matthias De Ligt. Yes, we got a top master. The Netherlands, um, Matthias De Ligt, obviously plays for Juventus as well. That is absolutely fantastic. Awesome stuff. De Ligt for the Netherlands. Nice. God. Again, we're, make, we're building a really defensive-minded team here, aren't we? This is weird, but Ericsson goes in. I think we'll bring in Lindelof because it's a nice a nice special card. And uh, Matthias De Ligt as well. Oh, crikey. Well, let's take out Lindelof straight away then and put in uh, yeah, Matthias De Ligt. That's a pretty good um, back five right there. Uh, we could we could take out Trippier, but I kind of want two full backs. We could probably push forward a bit like this, as you can see. Uh, so it looks a bit like that in game. I quite like that. Um, maybe a bit more of an out and out striker instead of Kul uh, Kulusevski. Uh, but we've got a nice top master, which obviously one in 16 packs. So fantastic stuff. Make just make sure to smash that like button for that pull. So let's see if we can get another one, by the way. Uh, we've got Conor Roberts there for Wales, Lucas Hernandez, Eden Hazard, nice Sillison, Dolberg, Celic. Um, obviously, Hazard hasn't been performing very well recently um, for Real de Madrid, but. Um, there we go. There's, there's some options in there. There's some options to think about. There's the code there, as you can see. And then we've got a Turkish international Hakan Çanakoğlu uh, fans' favourite. Uh, good little player, old Hakan. Good player. And oh my, oh wow! It's another epic card. It's very, very different to the dual cards. These are both platinum editions. Um, this glows in the dark. 
As you can see on screen now of the Brozovic glowing in the dark. So this is it on the right hand side, normal in daylight, in natural light. And then on the left is it uh, glowing in the dark, which is absolutely incredible. Um, it's known as a shining uh, shining star um, there. Mar uh, Marcelo Brozovic. Wow. Okay. Well, do we put, we'll put Brozovic in there instead of Rabio? Nice. That is absolutely fantastic. We've got some awesome cards so far in this opening, haven't we? Uh, do we want to put any more in? We'll put Hazard in just because he's a bit of a Premier League legend. I think we'll keep the rest as it is. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Sorry, Connor Roberts. Good player, but yeah, there we go. You're probably getting promoted to Swansea this season. So well done to you, Connor. If you're watching this video, smash the like button. Anyway, in this next pack, we've got Nikolic. We've got uh, Chilutska, Robin Olsen. Uh, Jorginho there, um, Chelsea's midfielder, of course, uh, playing for Italy. With Vlasic, Bernardo Silva. That's a very nice card. And a cheeky coat there, whatever it is. Oh, fans favourite, Kyle Walker for the mighty three lines. Look at that. The, oh, the England kit, by the way, is beautiful. I actually, I absolutely love it. It had a bit of criticism, but I really, really like it. It's a, it's a lovely kit. And then, oh, wow. What is that? I, I, I can't say your first name, mate, but Milik Goal Machine. That's a really wacky design, that. That is awesome. Nice goal machine of Milik. Oh, I love this collection. Continues to amaze me. Right. We'll bring in Kyle Walker um, because it's a nice shiny variant of the Kieran Trippier card we've already got. Um, same position kind of thing. Um, who else do we want from this pack? Jorginho maybe? Bernardo Silva definitely we want to put in there. He's a midfielder. We might have to take out one of the defenders actually. Let's take out Longley. Let's do it. There we go. So we've got uh, a 4-4-2 I think we're going to build now. If we move Ericsson there. And uh, yeah, Bernardo Silva can go on the right-hand side. There we go. So down to a 4-4-2 now. And I don't think... Do we put Jorginho in? Oh, I don't know. I don't think we will. We'll keep it like this. But in fact, actually, let's put Milik in instead of Anthony Martial. Nice. So we've got a nice shiny up top alongside Eden Hazard. Epic. Right. Let's go into the next pack. Let's see what we can get. Who's loving these cards, by the way? Um, let us know if you're going to collect these. Obviously, they are slightly more expensive, but as I explained in my, uh, my last Adrenal XL Euro video, there's a reason for that. Um, it's because it lines up the price of the rest of Europe. But um, in this next pack, we've got Harry Kane. Um, so Hazard, goodbye. We're putting Harry Kane in straight away. Nice. Uh, then we've got Zielinski, uh, Zinchenko, Vidra, Ozdoev, Lang. Cracking name, <laughs> Lang. Imagine being called Lang, that's brilliant. Uh, then we got a fan's favourite there of Vladimir Darida for Czech Republic. And, oh, it's him again, no! Uh, Milik, goal machine, again, brilliant. That is absolutely heartbreak hotel. Uh, I don't think any of those are going to get in, can't lie. What are the other cards in that pack? Anyone to write home about? Possibly Zinchenko, but no, we've got Robertson there. What am I talking about? We've got the beautiful, by far my favourite card design, Jewel of Andy Robertson. I absolutely love those cards. They are insane. Uh, there's Euronen, Elena, Leroy Sane, Paulson, Miranchuk, and there's a code. And then we've got uh, uh, Stefan Ilshanka for Austria. And there we go, fans' favourite. Oh, we've got three inserts in this pack, very nice. Uh, uh, Modric, Kovacic and Brozovic. The itches in midfield there, obviously we can't use that card in this dream team, but just appreciate the beauty of that card. I absolutely love it. I love the Czech, uh, the Croatia kit, sorry. It's just um, oh, it's just so iconic, isn't it? And then we've got Jan Bednarek, defensive rock um, for Poland. Obviously playing in a very struggling uh, Southampton side right now, but um, yeah, so I don't think he's going to get in. I don't think any of the players from that pack will get in, I can't lie. Um, yeah, no, I don't think any of those are going to get in. Okay, nice. This is a decent team, though. Where would this team finish, or let's say, in the Premier League? Where do you, re you reckon it would finish? And uh, how far would this team go in the Euro tournament as well? Uh, we've got Timo Werner there for uh, Germany. Uh, Kramaric, uh, Lobotka, Ginter, Arnautovic, Skriniar, um, who's obviously on the front of one of the pack designs, which I didn't realise in my starter pack video. I called him Kufau, and it's actually Skriniar, so apologies for that. Uh, there's the code card thing. Yeah, I'm not going to put Timo Werner in because he hasn't been doing too well, has he? So, um, there we go. I don't know how well Milik's been doing, to be fair, so I could be making a fool of myself. Uh, there's the Croatia home shirt. As I mentioned in the last pack, I absolutely love their home shirts. It's just iconic to football, really, isn't it? And then we've got a multiple 
Um, Maestro and Prodigy, Cruz and Havers. That's a nice uh, design there. Very innovative as well uh, with the idea of being uh, a Maestro and uh, it's uh, Prodigy. I quite like that. They did a similar thing, actually. Tops did a similar thing in their Best of the Best collection with Master and Apprentice. So um, I like that. That's a, that's a cool card. Obviously, you can't use in this team, but uh, yeah, very, very nice. Look at that. What, I love this team. I love these cards. Um, yeah, I'm going to bring out loads of openings for this collection because it's awesome. So we've got Ollie McBurney, Ansu Fati, very nice, uh, Jao Cancelo, Chiesa, uh, Masopust, Jao Felix. Oof, I think he's going to have to go in instead of Milik. There we go, Jao Felix, Milik comes out. There we go. And there's a code. Oh, we've got a forward at the back here. Go on, be an epic forward. Uh, we've got um, Juraj Kuka, fans' favourites for uh, Slovakia. And, oh, it's Joe Felix again. So, Joe Felix exception from this pack. This is another glow in the dark card. And as you can see on the screen now, there it is glowing in the dark for you, everyone. It looks fantastic. I love these uh, glow in the dark cards. You can't actually see the player really in its normal daylight. But once it goes in the dark, it really does glow in the dark. So, um, yeah, an awesome card. He goes instead of himself. There we go. Yeah, I'll tell you what. We're bringing on to Fatty instead of Brozovic. There we go. So Draxa stays in. And uh, there we go. We've got a front three of Kane, Fatty and Jao Felix. And the midfield is Draxler, Eriksson and Bernardo Silva. And then the back four is pretty decent as well. So what a team we've built so far. And there's still a decent amount of packs to go. So in this pack, we've got Arsenal's Granite Jack, obviously playing for Switzerland. Florenzi, uh, oh, there's a code there and I've just seen the main man. You know the relationship I have with Bruno Fernandes on this channel. He's going straight in. Goodbye, Mr. Julian Draxler. Very, very nice. And uh, as I mentioned before in the starter pack video, I do think Portugal will be winning the Euros. Um, so there we go. There's Aaron Ramsey, a uh, bit of a fan's favourite there for Wales. And obviously when he was playing for Arsenal. And there's a code. And then we've got a um, Burak Yilmaz. Fans' favourite for Turkey. Very nice. Then we've got Robin Olsen. A goal stopper there for Sweden. Lovely. I love the goal stopper design. And, oh, another top master. Two top masters in the 20 packs we've opened so far. Look at that. Euro top master, Luka Modric. I, oh, I love these cards. They are awesome. Oh, one in 16 packs. We've smashed the odds. This is what happens with Panini collections. You, you beat the odds really quite easily. Um, so it's oh, it's just awesome. I absolutely love that. Luka Modric, um, Euro top master. He goes in instead of Christian Eriksen. Look at that. Oh, what a team. That team is incredible. Even with Eriksen in, it was beautiful. So there we go. Let's get straight into the next pack. Two top masters, by the way. Oh, I absolutely love these cards. Absolutely love them. There's uh, Donnarumma, Wass, Augustinsson, uh, Frederick Jensen, uh, Ryan Christie, Nathan Ake, and then two insert cards here. We've got the uh, Thomas Delaney fans favourite for Denmark and a multiple here. Uh, Schlager, Baumgartner and Sabitzer. There we go for Austria. Lovely design card yet again from Panini. It's just oh, incredible. Incredible. I really want to get another one of those dual cards. That Robertson just keeps looking me in. It is the best uh, card design. I did quite like the Draxa card design. I've forgotten which kind of card it was, but that was beautiful as well. Uh, there's Callum McGregor, uh, Rodri, Scott McTominay, Pickford there. Um, Delict his base card. Obviously, he got his top master as well. I don't think any of those base cards will get in, I can't lie, uh, compared to what we've already got. Uh, there's the code. And then we've got a Wayne Hennessy fan's favourite for Wales. And we've got another glow-in-the-dark card. This time it is of... Who's that? It's Timu Puki. So, again, you know the drill by now. There it is, glowing-in-the-dark. Um, I don't know how long I'll do this glow and dark uh, demonstrations, especially when it comes to a booster box break, because we'll probably get quite a few of them. Uh, but there we go. Team of Pookie glowing in the dark for you on the left-hand side of your screen. Um, don't think any of those are going to get into the team instead of what we've already got. Yeah, so it's going to take a pretty decent card to replace what we've got already, I reckon, don't you think? Uh, there's Brozovic, Donnarumma. Okay. Himmel Courtois. Interesting. Was uh, Nestrovsky. What a name. Uh, Nestorovsky. There we go. That, that'll do. Uh, Braithwaite Soyunchu. There we go. There's the code. Oh, there it is. That's what the card design I really like is. Uh, it's between the key player and the jewel. I think they are the best card designs they've done in this collection. Old Panini. Uh, Kovacic there. Key player for Croatia. Nice. And a... 
Oh, wow. Marcus Rashford, fans favourite. There's obviously three fans favourites per team. So it's, it does get kind of, this collection does kind of give off a, a retro trading card collection vibe, like the match tax collections where it had three Man of the Matches per team. This has three fans favourites per team. I really, really like it. So Rashford, um, yeah, we'll put him in instead of Ansu Fati. There we go. Rashford goes in. Bit of a damaged card, unfortunately, that. And Kovacic, we put him in. I really like the car design. I really do. So it's it's kind of difficult. Um, yeah, I'll tell you what. We'll take out Ruben Diaz. We'll do a free at the back formation and make it a free for free. There we go. Free for free formation there. Very, very nice. Interesting stuff. So, yeah, there we go. Love it. Epic. Right. So, in this next one, we've got Augustinsson for Sweden. Yazici, Van der Beek, uh, Shiga, uh, Barisic, uh, Berezinski. Or Poland, I love these. All these, oh, I love this. I love Euro sets. I can't wait for the sticker collection, by the way, which will be out in April time, I imagine. Could be wrong, though. You never know when Panini will uh, release it. So we've got Piatov, fans' favourite for uh, Ukraine. And, oh, look at that. Declan Rice and Henderson, Maestro and Prodigy. Uh, that is insane. Look at that. <laughs> Soul collectibles. Um, there he is, of course, the uh, famous lookalike. Declan Rice and Henderson. That is awesome. I love that card. Oh, insane. Come on, England. Let's win this Euro tournament, eh? Let's do it, okay? Obviously, it's, it's going to be tight. Portugal, they're a good old team. Even without Ronaldo, I think Portugal have a very good chance. Uh, there's Guerrero there, obviously, of Portugal. Willie Orban. De Bruyne. How, how do you expect me to make a team? My goodness me. Kevin De Bruyne there um, for Belgium. Then we've got uh, Krachowiak. Very, very nice. Fans' favourite. We've then got Jordan Pickford, goal stopper for um, England. Very, very nice, that. And, oh my goodness me, our third top MasterCard. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh my lord, that is incredible. Wow, what a team we are building here. Who do we replace? Do we, let's get rid of Rashford. And then we've got Cristiano Ronaldo, Kane and Felix up top. Um, do we put Pickford in for the culture? Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Let's make this an English team. Come on. Here we go. Who else do we want from that pack? Do we want... Yeah, we want Kevin De Bruyne. What a team this is. Kovacic, out you come. Let's put in KDB. That team is absolutely incredible. Wow. Pickford is the slight weak point, though. Obviously, goal stopper. But three top masters from... We haven't even opened the 20 packs yet. This is absolutely incredible. There we go. I probably actually will put um, Courtois back in instead of Pickford. Um, but there we go. Let's get into this next one. We've got Perisic, uh, Duda, Frula, Pellegrini, Kovacic, Ruben Neves. Uh, there we go. And yeah, I, I think I am going to do it. I think that's uh, it's a bit silly of me. So let's put Courtois back in. Sorry, Pickford. It was nice knowing you and the team very, very temporarily. But uh, there we go. I, I, yeah, let's be sensible about this. Okay, I got a bit England excited there, didn't I? Uh, I've got Hugo Lloris. Whew. That is nice. That's a nice little card. Fans' favourite. And Granite Xhaka, key player. Don't think he's going to get in instead of what we've already got in midfield, um, which is an incredible midfield, by the way. And uh, obviously, Hugo Lloris, fans' favourite. I'll tell you what, now Courtois can come out and we'll put Hugo Lloris in goal. There we go. So it's a nice shiny and it's um, of equal quality, I'd say, to Courtois instead of Pickford, who's not quite <laughs> that kind of level, is he? You know, I don't see Pickford getting a big money move over to uh, Real Madrid anytime soon. I can't lie, but there's Memphis Depay. Sobal looks a bit like Andre Archer in there. Uh, Morata, Lord, McTominay. Thiago, obviously now of Liverpool, of course. I don't think he's going to get in, though. And then we've got a uh, Thomas Vaklik, a uh, fan's favourite card there for uh, Czech Republic. Very, very nice. And oh, look at that. I love the goal machines. They are awesome as well. This collection is insane. Um, Harris Seferovic there for Switzerland goal machine. They're not going to get in, but... Oh, it's just an awesome set. Here's our penalty foot pack. Can we improve this team anymore? Can we get another top master? Who knows? So we've got Bonucci there for Italy. Kiefer Moore. Christiansen. Uh, Rudiger. There's a security tag just dropped down on the desk there. Lovely stuff. And then we've got Baumgartner. Uh, who's that? Valgent. Or Valent, however you want to say it. Do any of those get in? I don't think so. No. Sorry, Kiefer Moore. A uh, bit of a bagsman, aren't you? But uh, yeah, not quite getting in instead of Jao Felix, Kane and uh, Ronaldo. Uh, there's the Russia home shirt. And there we go. 
and we've got a multiple Master on Prodigy Glick and uh, that guy. I'm not even going to give that an attempt. Shall we give an attempt? Go on then. Waluigi. Sounds like Waluigi. We'll call him Waluigi. There we go for Poland. Okay, here we go. Last pack. It's a Lewandowski, Xhaka and the Swedish, uh, Ukrainian geezer. Sorry, I'm on the front of the pack. Let's see what we get. Make sure to smash the like button for more Adrenaline XL content. And let's see if we can end on a bang. So, we've got uh, Dmitryevsky, uh, Semenov, Harry Kane again there, Clayson, Frankie de Jong, Harry Maguire. Very, very nice. Um, do we want any of those? Probably not. Can't lie. Sorry, Harry Maguire. And then we've got uh, Zakaria, fans' favourite for Switzerland. We've got Glenn Kamara, key player for Finland. Very, very nice. And that's it. I thought there was another card in there. Whoops. <laughs> but there we go. Glenn Kamara is what we finish on. And Zakaria for Switzerland. So there we have it. That was a 20-pack Dream Team Builder for the Adrenaline XL Euro 2020 2021 Edition Collection. Now, of course, we've built a pretty epic team here. As you can see, in goal, we've got Hugo Lloris fans' favourite. In defence, we've got Carl Walker, Matthias De Ligt, top master, and Andy Robertson, dual Incredible card design, by the way. Bernardo Silva in midfield alongside Kevin De Bruyne, Bruno Fernandes, and Luka Modric, Euro top master. And up top, we've got Jao Felix, Harry Kane, and Cristiano Ronaldo. If this team wouldn't win the Euros, I don't know what would. Um, so yeah, if you did enjoy this Euro 2020 pack opening, make sure to absolutely smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and of course hit the notification bell, that way you'll get notified to your mobile, tablet and computer device when I upload a new video to my channel, which is pretty, pretty epic indeed. So yeah, more Adrenal XL videos to come, more Match Tax videos to come, stay tuned, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.